All right, my friends, it's time to demo some mobile. We're going to have an official um, beta testing process eventually soon, but I'm really excited with how close we are to releasing, so I'm just going to jump the gun and show you guys what we've got so far. Um, first off, for those that don't know, it's open source over at Habit RPG Mobile. Okay. Um, if you know Angular JS, please pitch in. We could use all the help we can get. Um, and you just take this URL, you copy it, this thing right here, and you clone it to your local host. And then you, we use Cordova, which is PhoneGap, um, and it has this whole CLI for building the cloned URL, uh, the cloned repository. So I'm going to build the iOS application, and then you emulate it, and it brings up this emulator. Even though I have an Android, um, I don't have the Android emulator tool set up. It's a little bit more difficult. Okay, so here it is. So let's go to beta.habitrpg.com, where the API resides that we are going to be running the mobile app against. I'm going to log out and I'm going to log in with my dummy, my dummy user. Who is Lefnir. All right. So, as you can see, here we go. I have these, you know, they don't actually have proper names, but I can minus, minus, minus that a bunch, and you can see it actually appeared here. It's all in real time. And if I edit this guy, and I call him this, okay, and I refresh, boom, it shows up there. And it does this little, um, it does this cool, uh, what's called operational transformation. It kind of does proper data synchronization such that if I plus 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 and then over here I minus it okay it turned green but um, it applied the previous plus pluses and my minus minuses um, if that makes any sense so they they don't clobber each other and you can see if I call this frankly and I save oh well anyway okay so what do we got we got habits Everything, there we go, scroll. We got dailies. We got to do's completed and active. Rewards and your profile. You can go to customization. You can change your character's appearance. You can see on the website it's updating in real time. Um, and it updates on the mobile app. And um, over here, you can, um, if you want to log in with a different user, here you can enter in your API token and user ID, or you can just log out. And I'm going to log in with my main character because I have something. Uh, one frustrating part about all this is we, ha we can't, it, it was very difficult to implement Facebook authentication on the mobile app using PhoneGap, unfortunately. We're going to add that in, in the near future. But in the meantime, you have to um, you have to manually log in with your API token and user ID. Um, so just copy that in. So what you do is this green button says use ID and token. I'll make this more obvious, but this is instead of use, username and password. So when you click it, it switches to using ID and token. Oh, you can't paste. Well, okay, you can. And then you log in. There we go. Here's my uh, here's my my real character, my kind of production stuff. Um, so yeah, when you when you have a Facebook authentication uh, on the website, you have to use you have to use click this use ID and token green button. And you have to enter your API, uh, user ID, and API token. N uh, 
whereas if you're using username and password, you enter username and password. It's kind of confusing. I'll write a little thing about it, um, and maybe hopefully we'll make it a little bit more obvious anyway. But that's the mobile app. Uh, it will be released this week. iPhone take you know Apple takes forever to approve their apps, so it's probably not going to hit the Apple market for quite some time. I apologize. Android re releases immediately, so. Android will be released this week. There you go.